Girl, don't do it. It's not worth it. I'm not going to do it, girl. I was just thinking about it. I'm not going to do it. I did it. Hey, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Juliet, and this is my channel, Mama Tried. Yesterday, I was supposed to just go with Shayna to get some stuff to organize our freezers. We went to the container store and... Well, you see what happened. So I figured I'd show you guys what I got. The first thing that I got was this cool under the sink organizer. I'm gonna use this in my kitchen. So I thought that was really cool. I also got this Addison storage system. I'm going to put this in Loxie's playroom. And then, let's see what else, it's heavy, all right. And then this bag right here, I got three of these drawers that stack on top of each other and they just like slide out um, for my bathroom underneath my yeah. sink. If I like them, then I'll put them under the rest of the sinks, the bathroom sinks, but I wanted to try it out first. I also got this magic holder to put in my broom closet to hold like broom, steam mop, Swiffer, all that stuff. So wanted to try that out. So this bag. I got some Lazy Susans. Uh, the ones that I got for my kitchen organization were actually a little bit too big and my cabinet sticks out. So I was gonna replace the big one with these two little ones. I also got this um, avocado slicer. I've wanted one for a really long time and debated getting it, but whenever I saw it in the store, it was fate, so I had to get it. And then I also got this container for underneath my sink to put like my blow dryer because um, these you can move them around. So I was gonna put my blow dryer, straightener, curling iron, all those things in here. So that way they're all in one place because I just don't have a good system for that. I had one of those over the cabinet um, organizers for it and I hated it. So I don't know if I just had a fluke one, but it tore up my cabinet, it moved all around, it was, I did not like it. So I hope that this is a better solution. And then I also got these to organize my freezer. I looked in my freezer last night and I actually feel like these might be too tall, which I mean, it's fine because I can use this for something else anyway, but um, I got four of them. So stay tuned on my channel because I'm gonna be doing all kinds of organization to my house. I'm really excited. So last week I decluttered my house and we had a garage sale. I still have some stuff that I need to declutter, but I normally do three waves through my house. I do a total just purge. So I don't worry about anything else, I just purge. And then the next one I go through and organize and then I purge again because there's stuff that you find again that you're like, why did I keep this? And then the third round is a very deep clean and that is also a purge because each round you find something that you're like, why did I keep that? And it just makes you think about it over and over again. So I'm really excited to be doing that on my channel. I hope you guys will stay tuned. I will put it all in like my cleaning series so you guys can see that. And my goal for this summer is just to get my house nice and tidy. I mean, it's pretty organized and clean for the most part, but I'm, I want it to be like, Pinterest clean, you know, and super organized. So that is my goal for this summer. I'm super happy with my purchases from the container store. And I also wanted to share with you guys my Costco haul because I did a Costco haul yesterday as well. And I figured since I'm doing this far, I might as well do that. So let me grab all that stuff real quick. All right, you guys, so this is everything that I got from Costco. I re-upped on our paper towels and our toilet paper. I also get Luxie's diapers and wipes from Costco. I do the Kirkland brand on both. The diapers are amazing. I've said it since day one and also the wipes. So don't sleep on them because they're cheap and they're really, really good. Um, the diapers are actually the same as Huggies. They're made in the same factory and everything. They're just Kirkland brand and they have really cute prints on them. So anyways, I also got this pack of buckle up containers it says i can't remember how many there are one two three four five six so i got six of them and i want to say it was under ten dollars in the parking lot my receipt flew away so 
sorry about that. So I can't tell you exactly how much everything was, but I'm like 99% sure this was under $10. I'm doing all kinds of organization right now. I'm going to be organizing the entire house. So it's a huge project, but I am so happy that I saw these. And if they have them next time I go, if I need more, I will buy more because you really can't have enough of these, you know? So I got those. I re-upped on, this is like my normal stuff that I buy, on some fabric softener and um, some laundry detergent, I can't think right now, but I usually get the Kirkland brand one, but this one was on sale, the all free and clear, and that way I can um, wash Luxie's clothes in there too. The fabric softener smells amazing. I haven't ever had any issues with either of the Kirkland brand things, but I did get the all this time because it was cheaper and it was the same amount. I've been eyeing these at Costco for a long time. It's those uh, cotton bins. And I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with them yet. I might put them in our bathroom for um, towels and I might even do the same in Luxie's bathroom since there's two, there's a smaller one and then there's a large one. So I really like these and I wanna say this was, oh, it was on sale for 15. I remember that, these were 15, originally 20, which it's a great price for both of those. Honestly, it really is. I also have been eyeing these for a while too. We needed some new toilet brushes and um, they come with replacement heads, which I think is really cool. And I love all the, I don't know if it's OXO or OXO, but all their stuff I love, like love. Um, I re-upped on our trash bags. Shayna convinced me to get the scented ones this time. I normally just get the regular ones, but they're the same price and she said they smell pretty good. So we're gonna try those out. And I got some more shampoo. I'm a stickler for salon grade shampoo. That's it. Um, Biolage, Paul Mitchell, Purology, all that stuff. But I'm really picky about my hair products. My husband uses more shampoo and conditioner than I do. Thank you, Princess Stefano. And so I was running out of my very, very expensive shampoo and conditioner constantly. And then I decided to purchase the Kirkland brand shampoo and conditioner. It is amazing. No parabens, no sulfates. It's literally salon grade to me. It smells amazing. So I just got some more shampoo. Um, I've got some already, but I like to have some because I just don't want to run out. And um, that's like 647 or something like that for this entire huge thing. Like, that's crazy. It's really good too. And then the last thing, I believe, yeah, the last thing that I got was this crate for the back of my car. You just pop in the sides and it collapses. And I think that this will be really helpful for my Aldi trips and just to have in the car in general. I probably should have gotten two of them because they fold flat and that's super convenient. But I mean, to open it up, it's just opening it up. Just like that, oops. So I really thought this was cool and I wanna say it was six, seven dollars, like really cheap. And when I went to the container store afterwards, um, they had these for $20. And it also has a little spot right here where you can put uh, hanging files so that's really cool too and next time I go to Costco I might grab another one of these too because it might be convenient to have two in the back of my car but I just figured for all these trips because I bag my groceries at my car anyways and I'm sick and tired of buying bags whenever I go because of COVID-19 I haven't been reusing bags and taking them in the store to cut back on bacteria and germs so I've been taking everything out to the car and bagging it there and purchasing their paper bags and just throwing them away whenever I get home because the germs that could be on them. And I just, that's so wasteful. So I really hope that this helps me cut down on that and I can just um, put my fruits or vegetables in here and then spray it down with Lysol or whatever when I get home. So I really thought that this was super cool. I've looked at these before, but I never justified spending like $20, $30 on them. But since Costco had it for around $7, I was like, heck yeah, I'll try it out. So um, these were all of my Costco finds this time. This is the first time I've seen this crate there. Um, but everything else pretty much. Oh, these buckle up storage things. That's the first time I've seen those there too. But everything else is, um, I've seen there a lot like 
for months and months and months. So it's still there. And a lot of these are my normal Costco finds. I think that this is everything, you guys. This was such a huge haul uh, from Costco and the Container Store. I can never help myself at Costco. And that was actually my first time in the Container Store. And I don't know why, but I will definitely be going back. I'm going to be going through each room and organizing everything and trying to get it like as perfect as I can for a good price point. So I hope that you guys will stick around and watch those videos because they're going to be awesome. I also wanted to let you guys know until I hit 1,000 subscribers, I've got a giveaway going on on my channel. Um, I'll link that video for you guys, but it's a $50 Amazon gift card giveaway. Anybody can win. You just have to follow all the steps to do it. You have to be subscribed. You have to watch the video, comment on that video. So go over and watch that video so you can enter to win the $50 gift card. And I think that's everything, you guys. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more of my videos. Make sure to share this video with any of your friends and family that are Costco addicts or organizational addicts. I'm sure they'll really enjoy it. And once again, you guys, thank you so much for watching and have an awesome day. Bye.